And the Super Eagles and Denny Lispo of Turkey midfielder Ogenyo Nazi joins the program uh, via Skype from his base. Um, Ogenyo, let me start by asking you, uh, just like the MFM player Clement Ogu we just saw, uh, he said it's never an easy task for a football player to stay idle. How have you been coping uh, without going about your passion, which is football? Yeah, good evening. Um, <clears throat> Yeah, as he, as he said, it's not been easy um, doing what you know you've been doing every day. We go for trainings every day and then go for matches, weekends, depending on when the match is scheduled. And um, for now, we are home. Uh, it's really strange uh, for us. And uh, of course, anyone who is working every day, staying at home is going to be very difficult. In as much as we try to do the uh, exercises we do, but uh, it's not uh, enough because we need to do training uh, collectively as a team. And uh, it does affect a lot in the world, as you all know. And uh, we are just praying that it gets, it gets better and so everybody go, goes back to their work. All right. Um, well, for your family and loved ones, it is an opportunity to spend uh, more time with you. I mean, what has been their reaction? Well, unfortunately, uh, the day I was supposed to take my flight to Nigeria, that was the day the band, uh, I think they closed the borders for us to travel. And as you can see, I'm, out, I'm all by myself here. It's not been easy. My family is uh, in Nigeria and uh, I miss them a lot. It's an opportunity for me to stay with my family, stay with my kids and uh, close loved ones. But then there's nothing we can do. Uh, this is a, a crisis that is affecting the whole world and we have to comply to all the rules and regulations. And what have you been doing about your fitness ahead of a possible restart of football? Well, it's going to be difficult uh, at this point. We should just be honest to ourselves. Uh, we cannot train adequately on our own every day by ourselves in as much as uh, when we train as a team, we train uh, correctly and we try to do things well. but. The little fitness we're doing is okay for our own health and uh, for our own fitness as well. We will do the best we can, but uh, mentally, I don't think anyone is really 100% okay because, first of all, you need to think about the virus as a whole, think about the league, if it's going to be stopped or it's going to continue or it's going to be cancelled. And uh, also, of course, as you all know, financially, it's affecting everybody because so many teams are talking about pay cuts and all that. So. There's a whole lot of issues to be sorted out. Yes, I, I was about to ask you uh, that uh, um, because some clubs are actually taking um, austerity measures to ensure survival. I mean, players' income have been slashed. Um, is that also happening in Turkey at your club? Well, at this point, uh, we have not discussed about that uh, in Turkey because you're trying to make meetings and to know how everything is going to be uh, resolved. But... For sure, I know this is going to come up and uh, everybody has to comply, you know. It is a very difficult moment for everyone in the whole world, so everyone has to play a role in this. And uh, it's not going to be easy for so many people, and, uh, but we have to do it. This is, this is all it takes. Okay, well, um, it took a while before the Turkish football authorities postponed the league. Uh, why was that? And uh, what would be your reaction to how Trabzonspor parted ways with your compatriot John Michelubi over his stance that the league should have been halted uh, much earlier? Well, I think uh, Turkish league, uh, right from, uh, I think, January or December, when I was coming in to Turkey, I think I traveled home for something important, and I was coming back. I saw the Turkish uh, government, they tried to uh, install their cameras to be able to detect your temperature from afar. I saw it, it, it will not be visible for people who don't really pay attention. But anytime I'm traveling, I always pay attention. So I saw those cameras. I think they were trying to control, to curtail the, the um, people who are sick. And in as much as other, other leagues were trying to stop their league, uh, I think Turkish League, they, they were the ones who started to play without the fans in the stadium, which made it to be uh, less uh, people infected. So. Um, for me, they have reasons why. Of course, I don't know the personal data they have of people who are affected in the country. And uh, for that of our former captain, uh, Mikhail Obi, uh, well, this is a very sensitive issue uh, for him. 
uh, to make such kind of a statement. Uh, maybe the president of Travel Sport didn't take it uh, lightly with him, and uh, of course, somebody who of that kind of uh, caliber, you know, he's somebody who everybody respects. And uh, when he makes such kind of a statement, I don't know, you know, we, the choice of words, maybe the choice of words he used was not really appropriate for them. And so for them to take such decision is that that is their um, their own issues. But uh, for me, of course, I have nothing to say. This is our job. We have to do what we need to do. We Absolutely. are contracted to the clubs. We are contracted to the club clubs. So we need to uh, really uh, be careful in uh, any kind of statement we need to make. Of course, we know health is more important, but at least there are other important ways to be able to handle this matter. Okay. All right, before I let you go again on Nazi, you've not been um, in the Super Ego squad for a couple of months now. Uh, tell us, uh, what, what are you doing to get back into the squad? Are you in constant touch with uh, Coach Gernot Raw? Are you in constant touch with the national team? And how soon would Nigerians begin? Uh, I mean, how soon would Nigerians see you back in the Super Eagles fold? Well, um I was, as you all know, I was injured for a year. I was out, and um, throughout this year, when I came back, I'm trying to put myself into fitness, and I've been doing everything I can to put myself into uh, my feet, and uh, I've done that. I've started playing, playing 100%. The last game I played, I played 90 minutes, and uh, everything is going well. Uh, I don't, uh, I don't really um, have a lot of conversations with uh, every other coaches I play with. I don't have much conversations with them. The most important thing is for me to keep myself fit and get ready. Anytime I've been called up, I will go and uh, represent my country. Of course, this is what I love to do most. Uh, we have always been doing our best for our country. And uh, as far as we can still play football, there's every possibility for us to make our country proud. And so I'm ready for any call up. Absolutely. Many thanks to your game on Nazi, our Super Eagles midfielder and player of Denny Lee Sport of Turkey. Thanks for speaking with us live um, on the program from Turkey.